Well, hello there, everybody, and welcome back to a brand new episode of our NASCAR 15 career mode. How do you like this brand new paint scheme I just whipped up for our race? We're going next gen. We got the 77 push forward, Aaron's on the side, and safety clean on the back quarter panel. I think it absolutely looks beautiful. I finally figured out how to get this to work. I basically had to connect my Xbox 360 controller uh, to my PC instead of my Xbox One controller. So we have an absolutely incredible scheme coming here your way today and we're gonna head into Las Vegas and see what we have. I'm hoping we have a lot more speed here in Las Vegas. The car already drives so much better now that I'm on the like correct controller for it for this game that is so uh, I'm only gonna make one lap in qualifying we still have a really bad car we haven't made any upgrades but I'm hopeful uh, going into the next race in Phoenix we can actually upgrade our car on the inside of David Gilliland we're gonna clear him and look at that that's like the best lap we put in all season long right there it's probably not gonna do us anything uh, but currently slowest of everybody oh my god we didn't qualify last we are P37. These drivers have no idea what they are in for here as we're going to get underway in Las Vegas. Or you know what, everybody else is going to get underway. I'm not, but look at just this next gen car that they're going up against here. Uh, as we got Josh Wise there for Dogecoin just in front of us. I would like to be up on the top if possible. That's where I like to uh, drive. But this thing is pretty tight. Yeah, it's tight. It is tight. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Hello. Jeb Burton, Chase Elliott, the rookie, up my inside. Little did we know that would be a NASCAR Cup Series champion at the time. As we're 40th place. I keep forgetting there was 43 cars at this point uh, in 2015. Dale Earnhardt Jr. currently leading. I'm going to try the top right here. See if I can make it work a little bit. Jump up here and fight this tight handling car. Which we get through one and, and two decently. I'm in the outside wall. Oh yeah, we already... We already scraped that right side up very good, unfortunately. Get out of my way, sir. The bump and run. The bump and run for 39th place. It oh, yeah. Look at that momentum on the top. I'm not lifting. I'm not lifting. I should have lifted. I should have lifted. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry, Michael Waltrip. Okay, I made a lot of adjustments. The wedge has gone down. The track bar has gone up. I added a right rubber to this car. I don't know if that's going to do a whole lot here. Uh, we're going to find out. I'm hoping I didn't go too much because I took a huge swing at this car. So we're going to see what we got. Um, the goal is to just not finish last at this point here. We had a chance. Last episode was a really interesting one um, where we were all of a sudden like in the running to win the race and uh, it didn't quite work out at the end unfortunately here as I'm still tight. I'm still, I'm still really tight. Oh my god goodness save it save it Gary use your talent you don't have any that's why you can't save it oh my goodness now that I'm all by myself this thing is turning very very good and we are actually closing in a lot on the cars in front of us oh my goodness well isn't that swell not a good race so far for us here in this 77 next gen paint scheme-esque car but I'm confident I made some more adjustments in this car and I'm hopeful that those adjustments will do the trick this time around um, it felt good throughout the first few laps in the last run and then it got really tight again and obviously you saw how that ended so that was very unfortunate but hopefully right here we can just hang in there put up some good pace as I'm already I'm feeling that tightness kick in already it's just so tight I don't get it we can't waste any time. We gotta go. Coming through. I'm gonna use the inside. I'm not going to the top. Keep me away from that wall. I'm gonna pass every single one of you as we dive down into turn one. A little loose behind Kyle Bush. Oh, we are making some serious gains right here. Got into the 17 car, but that's okay. That's not a big deal. This is the best we've run all race long right here. Look at us go. Look at us. P31, baby. Denny Hamlin out in front. To the inside of Joey Logano. Oh, I'm sideways. That's okay. Throw a block there on Allgaier. Sailing off into turn three. Oh, this car is rolling right now. 
I feel like this is our big reality check though, where, get out of the way Joey, um, we're seeing the raw pace actually become an issue where we're, it's very tough to pass, uh, as we go down into turn one up the inside of Matt Kenseth, I forgot about that paint scheme, that's a really nice scheme right there, and, uh oh, oh, not again, oh my goodness, it just completely kicked out on me, and Bobby Labani, Okay, we're fine. We're fine. That was just a one-time thing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. This is absolutely insane. And we got cars pitting. Oh, perfect. I don't know. I don't think it's going to be close. That We might be able to make it to the end of this race. Um, We might not be able to, though. We're going to find out real quick, I'm sure. Pretty promising for us so far. As... Oh no 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 Oh no I know this sounds crazy but I decided to stay out there's only gonna be five laps to go okay everybody behind us has fresh tires including Jeff Gordon but I am confident that this is the winning strategy right here. And I'm going to prove that because we got a good launch. Who do you think you are trying to pass on the apron, Brad? Five laps is all we got to hang on for. Chase Elliott. Chase Elliott. Why? That was my fault, but why? Oh, we're going to be four wide. We're going to be four wide. This field, this packed cars, they're not going to be a fan of me anymore. Well, they probably weren't anyways to begin with, but... Oh, goodness. Tony, I'm going to need some room. Thank you. Four wide again. If we can just get a top 20 out of this, I'd be pretty I'd be pretty happy. And uh, we're just going to settle in behind that 14 to Tony Stewart. There's a huge checkup. Greg Biffle, the Biff. And I forgot he had that big ant spray car. And I'm going to be spraying him into the wall. He's okay. We're all okay. Casey Kane, Chase Elliott's pitting. Why Why did you stay out if you got a pit? Look at that. We're still P6. What a run. I gotta say, this game's a lot of fun to play. Because it's not like you gotta take it seriously or anything. We're just here to have fun. And that makes it a lot of fun here. As we dive down into turn one. Staying ahead of the Biff. Here comes Casey Kane in the mirror. I see him coming. I'm gonna throw a block if he gets here. Maybe a little bit too late of a block. We've got more cars pitting. I'm not pitting. I don't have to pit. We're going to make it to the end. More cars pitting. There's the 17 of Stenhouse. I don't remember what happened to Jeff Gordon. But I'm like, wait a minute. Oh, goodness. What if everybody still has to pit in front of us? We might have a chance to win this race. Only two laps to go. In Las Vegas, we're okay on fuel. We got the 47 of AJ Allmendinger closing in behind us. This is going to be the telling moment right here. Is anybody going to pit? No. Okay, so um, we're not going to win. But we definitely made a really good call staying out. Final lap here in Las Vegas. Can we hold off the 47? I just want a top five. I'd be very happy with that. And Allmendinger is a little high up the track. He's right to my back bumper. He uh, made a mistake, it looks like. And we lead that fifth place car. Down the back straightaway into three and four for the final time. Come on. Oh, it's so tight. That's okay. That is okay. That is okay. That is okay. We're going to have to throw a huge block on David Reagan, but we finished fourth. What a call to stay out as we somehow managed to hold off the majority of the pack and end up in the top five here in Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Uh, we need some upgrades to this car, that is for sure. Let's check out the finishing order. Kozlowski wins as we're going to scroll through the rest. McMurray rounds out your top 10. Michael Annette rounds out the top 20. What happened to Jeff Gordon? He is all the way down in 31st place after that restart. So um, interesting to see that happen there as Harvick ends up down in 40th. Hamlin with the fastest lap in 36th. Okay, look at that. We're up to third in the standings. It looks like... So far, yeah, I think the standings are actually correct now in the actual correct point order. So, that's nice to see. Because last episode, they were all over the place. Logano is all the way down in 40th place. He's had a terrible start to the season. Let's check out before we end it. Uh, we can't afford an engine shop 
upgrade, but we would only have 7,000 left over. Um, but I think we're going to do it and I hope that does something. Actually, I think that's just to do research. So I don't even know if we get anything out of it before. We're, let's just see here if we jump into Phoenix. Oh, no, we got an in-house engine, but we go into debt. We can't even use it. Oh, man. Okay. So we're going to go into Phoenix uh, with like refurbished everything, unfortunately. Um, so we'll see how that goes. As always, if you guys enjoyed, you know what to do. And I will see you guys in the next one at Phoenix Raceway. Have a great day, everybody. Thank you.